<laughs> anyway, I love this town. You know I do. So, I'm dedicating my last jokes to specific people here tonight. The first one's for Maureen. A guy walks into a bar, and dozens of slabs of meat are hanging from the ceiling. So he asks the bartender, what's up with the hanging meat up there, man? So the bartender says, ah, you're new here. Well, we like to play a game here. If you can jump up and slap a steak, the house will pay for your drinks all night. However, if you miss, you have to pay everyone else's bar tap. So, wanna give it a go? Nah, says the man. <laughs> Those steaks are too high. <laughs> this one's for our own newcomer, Meredith Weiss. So, a woman's driving down the freeway, but all of a sudden, she hears a local news bulletin warning drivers on the very freeway she's on. They're saying, Please be advised of this very dangerous situation of a car going the wrong way. So the woman says to herself, one car? <laughs> Why, there's dozens! Well, folks, wasn't that special? <laughs> now, let me know if any of you have any jokes about Jack, you hear? It's an open mic, after all. <laughs> it's actually time for a little break right now. So, come on up to the bar for some of our finest concessions. We'll continue shortly. Mildred, how are you? And how are the cats? Fine, on both counts, dear. Thank you for asking. So, do you like the hair? Hmm. Looking fine as always. Thank you, dear. Pity it's quite the waste of time and money. Seeing as how I can't stay for long. Really? What's the rush? You see, my son decided to drop by. Unannounced. And he's staying the whole weekend. Um. Oh, that's wonderful news. Mm-hmm. All right. Well, anyway, take care, dear. Now, where did he park the car? <laughs> Yes, it's me, Matt Kearney, in an egg brace. Real funny, huh? I must admit, it, it's at least a little funny. What happened? Well, I was about to send the final boss to the afterlife, but then the computer crashed. I kicked my foot out in anger and fell from my chair, and now I'm here looking like a loser. Um... I'm sure you'll beat the game one day. Don't give up on the dream. I can't play like this, but I'm going to work out a strategy in the meantime. Dear people, none other than our own Kay Evans will perform next. She has been writing songs since she was a little girl, and I cannot say how thrilled I am to host her first performance of hopefully many to come. I am so proud of you, honey. Please, put your hands together for Kay, everyone! This does not happen a lot, but you have left me speechless. That was K, people. Another round of applause. Well, it's a good thing I didn't leave when Reynolds started his nonsense. Hmm. This kid can sing. Oh, hi, Mr. Mackey. Yeah, she's awesome. Yeah, it's good to see someone flourish, but I'd rather be home right now. Isn't it fun to step out every once in a while? 
Smoking a pipe and reading a proper book is the only acceptable way to spend a Sunday evening in September. <laughs> Bert, thank you so much for coming. I know you'd rather be somewhere else right now. That's okay, kid. I don't regret it one bit. You did great. But ladies, if you'll excuse me, I'm out of here. Good night, Bert. Thanks again. And now for an announcement. I'm serious, so hush now. Now, you all know that Kay has been working here at the diner for quite a while now. In fact, she was my anchor after Stan left us. And I think the time has come to formally announce right here that I will put your name above the door of this place, honey, where it belongs. Kay's place, Mo Kay's. We haven't settled on a name yet. But <laughs> There you go. Another round of applause. And have some drinks with us. Mm. That was amazing. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much, Em. It felt amazing. I was so super nervous, you know? Like, shaking and all that. I'm so glad it went well. Mm-hmm. Kay's place, huh? Congratulations! That was quite a surprise. Yeah, I told you. Mo asked me like a gazillion times, right? Kind of felt right this time. We haven't hashed out any details, as you might have noticed. <laughs> but it feels good, you know? How did it feel to be up there? Oh, it was so great to be performing again. It felt amazing. I'm all over the place right now. It was such a rush. I will definitely be doing that again if they let me of course that's great <laughs> i am so proud of you Kay. you really have made a great life here thanks um i'd like to think so big day tomorrow right you know what you're going to do honestly well <sighs> wait i'm not good at this stuff so i just want to say it was good to have you back these past weeks and really good you just do what you feel you have to do I'm just glad we reconnected. Promise you'll keep in touch? Whatever the outcome, yeah? Of course. And remember, time marches, marches on. on. <laughs> See you, Kate. Thanks. For everything. My lovely people! The time has come for the open mic part of the evening to end. Ashley was going to do a ventriloquist bit next, but I just heard he hurt his hand back in his cabin. <laughs> Let me thank you again for joining us. And there's plenty of food and drink to go around. I sure do hope they're keeping things proper in there while I'm taking a breather. So, you had fun? Oh, it was great. Kay was amazing. You said it. Oh, that girl is so talented. Oh, I'd give my big toe to be able to do what she does behind a keyboard. Oh, sheesh. <sighs> I'm still thinking about your news about handing over the diner. Kay's place, huh? That was quite the bombshell. That's my style. I've mentioned it to Kay, yes, many times since Stan died. She probably thought I was joking half the time, honestly. I just want to give her the option. It's hers whenever she wants it. And if she doesn't, that's fine too. Hmm. Yeah, but how do you make a choice like that if you don't even know what your own situation will end up looking like? Something on your mind, hon? I don't know. I'm, I'm feeling a bit weird about tomorrow. How did things end up with Kay? You could tell me to mind my own, of course. It's just that that girl is like a daughter to me. We talked, yeah. Wir haben uns wieder gut verstanden. Ich bin froh darüber. Ich glaube, es sind jetzt andere Menschen. Ich werde immer liebevoll an unsere gemeinsame Zeit zurückdenken. Ja, nee, Quatsch. We really reconnected. And I'm happy we did. <laughs> Listen. You're two grown women. And if that's the choice you two ended up on, I can only respect that. Speaking of choices, you've got a big day in the morning, don't you? Know what you're gonna do yet? Stick around, move back. 
<sighs> Honestly, no. No clue at all. Sounds like you're feeling a lot of pressure. No, I just wish things were a bit more clear. <sighs> you know what I've found? Screw clarity. You don't need clarity to make choices. Hmm? How so? I swear. People these days seem to think that because they can calculate and approximate, they can clear up the secret to existence. Like, life's a game you can win or lose. Pretending you know exactly where future you wants to end up. And plotting that out for the rest of your life? Huh, I'd almost say that's arrogant. Not to mention boring. The beauty is in not knowing, if you ask me. Hmm. But how do you live your life then? Want to know my advice? You take that one first step and see where it leads you. You can never truly predict the one that comes after. And whatever path you take will come with its ups and downs. There will always be joy. And there will always be regret. But that's something to be thankful for. That's what makes life yours, doesn't it? Hmm. Duncan. Thanks, Maureen. It makes sense. You'll be all right, huh? You just keep checking what feels right. And if not... Just take that first step, you hear? Maureen? Thanks. For everything. I best get back inside. You take care now, Meredith Wise. Take care, Maureen. Ah. Kann die ganze Zeit nicht zwischenspeichern? Nee, ich kann nicht zwischensprechen. Okay. Dear Meredith Weiss, thank you for participating in our annual photography contest. Your wonderful picture did not win the grand prize, but you are still a winner. The attached voucher gives you a 20% discount to our autumn course. Sign up today and never take a blurry picture again. David Gillespie, Photography for Beginners, Inc. Good morning, Meredith. You won't believe the weekend I had. Saturday, I placed a bet on the Angels, just like you said, and won. But they played again yesterday, and I let it ride, and then they lost. <laughs> They're playing again tonight, and now I don't know what to do anymore. Well, Frank, the pattern is obvious. You're a gambling addict beyond salvation. Haha, <laughs> Meredith. I guess you're right, and I guess I don't mind. Speaking of gambling, I bet you're taking the job, and that's not just because you're wearing your coat. I love the coat, Frank. Trotzdem ziehe ich ihn aus und verlasse die Stadt. Kann ich zwischensprechen? Nein. Und ja, ich werde ihn noch etwas länger tragen. Zurück in ihre Karriere? Weil er sie gerade den Durchbruch hat. Aber der sie ja abends alleine in ihrer Wohnung sitzt. Oder hier bleiben, die Karriere sausen lassen und schauen, was das Leben bringt. Geld allein macht nicht glücklich. Und nur weil du eine Karriere hast, macht es dich auch nicht glücklich. Auf der anderen Seite wird sie es vielleicht bereuen, wenn sie es tut. Wenn sie ihre Karriere sausen lässt. Wird sie es vielleicht bereuen? Man weiß es nicht. Für mich persönlich stand die Entscheidung von Anfang an fest. Und ich werde es einfach bei mir, von meinem Gefühl her, durchziehen. Wir bleiben. Und ja, ich möchte es ein bisschen länger Fantastic. So you'll be delivering the mail today? I'll give HR a call and tell them the vacancy is filled. Eh, eh, not so fast, Frank. It's under one condition. Ähm, ich will meinen Anteil entfernen, Anteil und einen Buchmacher gewinnen. Beim nächsten Ärger bist du auf dich allein gestellt. Och man. If you get in a predicament with Walter Morgan again, you're on your own. Ha, you got it. 
I'll have Morgan for breakfast. Now, let's get to work. The mail doesn't deliver itself. Okay, let's see what today's weather will be like. P.O. people, good morning! Today's weather will be nothing short of gorgeous, and I can't wait to go outside and head out to the acres. But not before sharing, you know what? P.O. positive or pet peeves? I don't need callers for today's P.O. positive. I'm picking it myself. <laughs> I'm talking about Moe's open mic last night. Uh, I hope y'all enjoyed it as much as I did. And I'm sorry if I offended anyone with my jokes. Well, no, actually, I am not sorry. Not sorry at all. Thank you much, Mo and Kay, for hosting it. It's just one of the things that makes Providence Oaks the best place in the world. Have a great day. Uh, <laughs> you tell him, Jack. What's this guy up to? Wait, is that Robert? Y yeah, yeah, Robert, I'll pull over. Mm-hmm. Hey, Meredith, sorry about that. I hope it didn't scare you. Hey, Robert. What's going on? Well, this is gonna sound super awkward. And hopeless. And desperate. And probably a lot more things, but I don't want you to leave. I've decided a while ago that I'm done with stuff like this, but I guess it's not something you can decide. Robert, that's so sweet of you, but I'm not going anywhere. Yeah, I figured you'd say that. I... wait, what? You're not going? Yep. It's nice here. Oh, wow. Uh, okay, great. Well, I might as well blurt it all out. I like you. A lot. I didn't want to give in to it. I've been through a rough breakup once. And I didn't want to risk ever feeling like that again. I have mail to deliver. Also, soll ich einfach in dein Auto hüpfen? So, what do you propose? That I just get in your car right now? Well, I wasn't gonna propose, but yeah, Meredith, I'd love that. Das kann ich nicht tun, aber ich rufe dich an. Hallo, okay. es kommt. Coffee at Moe's? And a piece of pie. <laughs> Sorry for butting in, folks, but I've got a special treat for y'all. I just updated my playlist. This new song is from our very own Kay Evans. Ach, wie schön. Wir lassen es auf jeden Fall durchlaufen. Was für ein wundervolles Spiel. Wie Urlaub. Ich kann es nur immer wieder wiederholen. Ich kann mich nur noch mal bedanken. Dinky. Großartig. So ein tolles Spiel.
Musik ist immer noch mein Highlight in dem ganzen Spiel. Alles ist mein Highlight an diesem Spiel. Wir werden jetzt im Anschluss nochmal laden und die andere Entscheidung wählen. Was für ein tolles Spiel. Ich komme gar nicht drüber weg, ich liebe dieses Spiel. Es ist so wunderschön. Ich wippe hier gerade vor mich hin <lacht> zur Musik. Ja. Es ist so wunderschön. Alter. Danke, dass ihr Lake spielt. Danke, dass ihr Lake entwickelt und veröffentlicht habt. Vielen Dank dafür. So toll. Einfach so toll. Okay. Wir... Ich sage erstmal Dankeschön fürs Zuschauen, denn äh, wir sehen uns dann in der nächsten Folge wieder und dann probieren wir den anderen, das andere Ende aus. Und ähm, sehen uns dann in der nächsten Folge, wenn wir die Stadt, diese Kleinstadt hier verlassen. Bis dahin, macht's gut. Ciao.